Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, well, around the 19th. So, you know, the timing is fluid. What do we have for a message today? What do we have for around the 19th? Three of Swords. Three of Swords. It looks like uh, that is painful. Okay, that's painful, scary. Um, being stabbed. Okay, this is being stabbed, being hurt. This is heartache. This is suffering. This is pain. Okay, this is heart pain. Okay, so. Uh, wow. This is definitely heart-wrenching, okay? I think there's a lot of uh, it's almost like begging. It's like begging, like, please stop, please stop, please stop, that kind of thing, you know what I mean? Please stop hurting me. You know, why are you hurting me? That kind of thing. I hate to start off a reading like this, but the Three of Swords, that's painful. That's heartache. That's suffering. I don't know if there's going to be a loss or something, or there is if somebody who's experiencing a loss. Ten of Swords. Oh, my God. You know... This is this isn't a pretty way to start out a reading. I mean, this is. Uh, I mean, I mean, I'm not sure if there's gonna if there's a death or what. I mean, I, I, what am I supposed to say? You want me to pretty that up? I'm sure there's somebody that could make up some pretty fairy tale out of these two cards, but it ain't me. Okay, this ain't no fairy tale. All right, absolutely not. So three of swords, ten of swords, upright, reverse, whatever you got here. It looks like we got a painful situation that is probably coming to an end. It is probably coming to end. Somebody, you know, I'm going to be honest, they may not survive. Or they may barely survive. Okay? I mean, this is, uh... Also, you made your bed, now you get a lie on it. If somebody may have really stabbed somebody. They really hurt somebody. They broke somebody's heart really 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 bad and now they are suffering uh yeah now they're suffering so there's some sort of real real serious pain here um it's like the worst has happened the worst has happened Something could also be coming back from the dead. In and uh, last time I said this, somebody said, "What do you mean something comes back from the dead? People don't come back from the dead." You, it's a metaphor. And if you don't know what a metaphor is, look it up. People ask this, the crazy. It's like they just want to fight. something that has died previously that hurt you or you hurt them is could be coming back could be coming back around okay I don't know something with that ten of swords reverse it's like this is it's uh, six of pentacles six of pentacles reversed that is abuse of power domination, greed, and injustice. Somebody could be doing something that is against the law. There's definitely an abuse of power here. There is. There is. Taking away something. Somebody is, I don't know if there's a rejection or they're being taken away. Somebody could be taken away, okay? Um, I'm not sure what is going on, but it looks as though there could be a serious uh, situation here where... You know, somebody is abuses, there's abuse, okay? There's some sort of abuse. Um, I 
Nine of Pentacles reversed. Wow. Unstable, insecure. This could even, for some of you, somebody's losing their job. I mean, they're really losing their job. They're losing money. And that could be part of this this thing that's happening. Okay, we are, we are going through an epidemic right now. And, you know, it could be a painful reality that somebody is, is I mean, the Nine of Pentacles can be a business owner or somebody that uh, makes their money independently. Okay, so this person may be losing money because this is losing money as well. Losing money and that really hurts. It does. It hurts when you know when you, you know, there, there could be some sort of business situation that is coming to an end. It's coming to an end because of this epidemic. Okay, so that could certainly be, that's definitely happening, I'm sure. Um, Nine of Pentacles reversed. This is... Losing stability, losing security, not very stable, not very self-sufficient, can't take care of the situation, and um, weak. There's some element of weakness here. Um, Queen of Wands reversed. Oh my God. Uh, Queen of throwing a tantrum. So we got somebody here that may be throwing a tantrum, maybe acting hysterical. There could be somebody that there could be another woman. We could have uh, another woman that is in the mix here that is causing problems. Somebody is getting hurt. Queen of Wands reversed. It's a very dramatic time, overly dramatic. Somebody could be seeking revenge. This person is unhealthy, they're jealous, they're weak, and controlling. So we have somebody here that is losing their ground, okay? They are, they're losing their ground. They're, and they could, I don't know if this is a business or what, or even in general life, okay? This is losing ground, um, losing it, losing it, losing it. Um, very unstable. So we have somebody here that is unstable, insecure, uh, can't take care of themselves, you know, don't, they can, but they don't have the strength to take care of themselves or the willpower or something like that. This could be laziness. We could have somebody here that is lazy. This person is a fighter as well, you know, says things, wa wants to fight. And it's funny that I said that a minute ago. Somebody just wants to fight. I said that a, f a few, maybe a few minutes ago. People say things, and this is what we got here, say things because they just want to fight. Somebody could be picking a fight, and I'm telling you what, this picking a fight, everybody's on edge. I wouldn't be picking a fight if I was you, because if you pick a fight, you could end up getting hurt. So I feel like, I feel like, uh... We have somebody here that is suffering and they maybe, maybe they're, you know, they're suffering on, on their own and they, they can't find a way to pick themselves up or to get out of this rut. They can't. There maybe there's fear that they're not going to survive, but this, you may survive or you may not. Somebody's going to get hurt or they're being hurt or they're hurting right now with the three of swords. This is pain and suffering that, uh... You know, it looks like there's some sort of loss here. Somebody may be getting rejected. They may be getting let go. They may be getting fired. They may be getting uh, pushed away, you know. Uh, this person may say something stupid without thinking, and they, they get let go. Okay? Just saying. Somebody may get let go. Um... There's definitely a loss of income here with these two cards. There's a loss of income. Um, that Ten of Swords reversed is a desperate situation beyond help. We could have somebody here that has some chronic health problems. I don't know if they're heart problems or something like that. Could be heart problems, could be um, back problems. Um... Two of Swords. Two of Swords is uh, 
a stressful choice, a stressful decision, facing the opposition, in denial, unable to see the truth, blocking emotion, choosing not to see the truth, pretending, Pre somebody is pretending, somebody is pretending, they're pretending that they're stable and secure, they're pretending that uh, they're good and they're not good. We do also have somebody here that has double loyalty, you know, they're loyal to more than one person. I feel like there is another woman Okay, for some of you, there's another woman here, it, but the, the person, somebody is getting hurt really, really bad by an individual. They're being hurt by this individual. This person is probably with them just because they don't want to be single and they're, they're in love with another woman by the looks of things because somebody is, is suffering and, and they're staying in that situation. They're, 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 they're stayed in that situation. Now they've reached the point of, it's like the peak, they've reached the peak where uh, now it's do or die, you know, it's, it's come to an end. This is going to come to an end. Now oh, wait, somebody is making a pain. This is painful. This is painful. So a painful decision. It's like they know that they have to do something, but they have been avoiding it. They've been avoiding, um, uh, ending something with somebody that they probably, uh, don't want, it's not, you know, the Six of Pentacles reversed, there's lack of reciprocation, there's lack of give and take, there's, uh, it's, it, there's, there's an unequal balance here, so somebody isn't getting what they want, or they're not giving, you know, there's not equal give and take, but it looks to me as though, it looks to me as though somebody has been pretending, they've been pretending that they were good, and now something happens, where they decide that, you know, I, I got to do this. I got to, I got to uh, terminate this. You know, I got to terminate. That's what it is. I got to terminate this uh, situation. It's not, it's not practical in any way. Somebody is thinking about somebody from their past or they're remembering their past or it's, it's very prominent here. We have the six of cups. There's a lot of nostalgia. There's memories of the past that are coming up that are very prominent here. So I feel like we, we have a painful separation that is that is ensuing. And I think it is ensuing because uh, maybe this other person that is very forceful throws a fit. Throws a fit or throws a tantrum or, you know, decides not to give, okay? Because she's just not going to give anything. She's very... Um, I mean, the Queen of Wands in reverse is somebody that is oh, well melodramatic. She's melodramatic, and she's. I see a lot of unhealthy behavior here too. We have somebody here that is, is very, very, very unhealthy. But this is making a decision. Somebody has been blocked or they've been blocking their emotions. They've been blocking the truth about their feelings, about how they really feel. And I think it has to do with something that has already ended. That they they neglected or they rejected in the past. Now we have somebody here that, you know, on, you know they, this is divided loyalty. On one hand, you know, they want to go back. But on the other hand, you know, they, they know they're going to hurt this other person. So we have, we definitely have a choice that is being made, a, a difficult decision that is being made. Somebody is getting hurt with the Three of Swords. This is like being caught in the middle. Somebody is caught in the middle of a painful situation. But this right here, this Ten of Swords reversed, is things getting worse. Things getting worse. Stress. There's a lot of stress here. It's like, now it's like you can't even work. There's Things are so unbalanced. That it's crazy. It's like, oh my God. Things are, it's like, it's, it's like a nasty situation. King of Wands coming to the rescue. 
King of Wands, he is. He's coming to the rescue. So we have somebody here that is is taking action. This King of Wands is taking action. He's coming to somebody's rescue. This this person right here is all alone. She may be be being hurt by somebody else or she's been hurt. This is this is a the nine of pentacles is the empress and the minor arcana. It's reversed. This is a woman or somebody that doesn't know her value. She lacks self worth and value. We talked about this on my other channel last night. So this is a woman that doesn't know her value. She doesn't know her worth. She's been hurt. She's been hurt very, 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 very badly. Near death experience. Un unable to open up. This is blocking emotions. Somebody is is block blocked. They're blocked, or and they need to unblock. They need to open up. This King of Wands is taking action. He is strong. He is a fighter, and he has no fear. This guy has no fear. So it looks as though it looks like he is taking this person. It's funny because this I think I said I can't remember about being taken away. Somebody being taken away. Um, so I think that we have a, a masculine here that is coming to the rescue. He is coming to the rescue. He's coming to save the day. <laughs> Before it's too late. Before it's too late. He's going to take action before it's too late. He is. She has a lot of insecurities. This person has a lot of insecurities. And I think this person has a lot of insecurities because of the previous pain that they have been through. Going for a ride. Cancer. This is the chariot. But this is uh, finding the ability to take that, take control of a situation. Uh, willing, willingness. So we have somebody here that is willing to take control, willing to uh, take the lead. Somebody that is very determined, the determined to bring success, to be, to make this successful. The determined to. Um, go in a new direction. This is uh somebody that's gonna put in some hard work. They're ready to face the opposition. We have somebody that is taking action and they are willing to face any opposition to bring success to some sort of union because twos are unions, they're partnerships. I think we have this person that is, I mean, this is taking a ride. Somebody is, it's like somebody is arriving. Somebody is arriving and they are, they're taking you. It's like they're, they're going to take you somewhere. I really feel like that. Somebody is being taken somewhere. They're being taken, taken for a ride, taken uh, to a better place. But they've also been dealing with a really nasty individual. I mean, the Queen of Wands in reverse is nasty. You know, she uses the silent treatment. She screams. She asks, acts hysterical. She she uh, she uh, pouts. She pouts. She stomps off with a dirty look on her face. Um, she pouts to get her way. So we have this this Queen of Wands in reversed that is losing power because it's reversed. She's feeling powerless. She's very frustrated. She's frustrating. She likes to be in control, and when she's not in control, she gets very, very, very upset, and she and it shows. 
everybody can see it. It's very melodramatic. It is. Everybody can see it on her face because she wears it in her look. I feel as though we have this person that has been hurt very, 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 very badly. This person, um, is losing it. They're losing it. They're losing it. They're losing their ground. They're losing their stability. They're losing their, they're, they're, they're very insecure, put it that way. And it shows, it shows. It's like they can't, they can't master their emotions, but it feels like somebody is arriving that is going to help them. They're going to help them to master their emotions, to calm down. I'm here. I'm here to help you. It's like help is arriving. Help is arriving. I really feel like this, like this is somebody coming to the rescue. I really do. We have somebody here that's been trapped. It's like this person is going to cut them free from this painful situation that they have been, you know, holding on to. Um, whoever it is that is arriving, because there is an arrival here. There is an arrival. This person is strong. This person is strong. This person is fearless. They're fearless. They may be a traveler. They may travel a lot. This person has a lot of self-discipline and a lot of self-control. They are able to control their emotions very, very well. They they are coming to uh, save. They're coming to save somebody. It looks that's what this is. So it starts with some sort of pain with the three of swords. That is pain and suffering. Somebody has blocked their emotions because of, and this is blocked. This is blocked emotions, unable to open your heart, unable to express, in denial, unsure, uh, confused, unwilling to see, unwilling to accept. And, not, and, and really harboring a lot of insecurities here. We have somebody here that is very, very, very insecure. And it feels like this person is 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 down. Okay, they're down. They're down, 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 down. And now somebody has is arriving to help them come back up. I just happened to notice that rainbow. The storm is over, right? The storm. The difficulty is over. The difficulty is over. This person is not going to burn you. It's like they're coming to take you to a better place. So yeah, I mean, I don't think I need to go any further. I feel like there is somebody that is, is, is going to show up. They're going to show up. They're going. They're going to show show up at uh, just in time. Just in time. Could be two days. What the hell is this? This guy is taking action to save the day. He is. Hermit. That's what I just cut it to. The hermit. This is somebody that is very wise. A very wise individual here. Hermit is... Um, it means that you need to, take, need to take a time out. You need to reflect. You need to uh, withdraw. This is about alone time. It's about realizing your true identity. But I believe that we have somebody here that is 
coming out, coming out of the darkness. It's like they're ready. This guy's ready. It's like he's, he's, uh, he's smiling. He's been in hermit mode. And he's ready. He's become enlightened. And he, it looks like he sees something. He sees something. And I think he's ready to leave the past behind. I think he's ready to go. So I think we have a very wise individual here who has gained some sort of wisdom and clarity through uh, you know, being in hermit mode, being alone. He, he obviously blocked his emotions, but now he's ready. I think he's ready. It's like he's, he sees, he sees the light, he sees something beautiful and he wants it and he's going for it and he's going to take action. So I believe we do, ha and I think it's a masculine that is going to take action because he sees something beautiful that interests him and he's ready to come out of this darkness. So get prepared. We have a Virgo, we have a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and we have a Cancer. I feel like, like, uh, there is also somebody that is being left behind. It's like the choice is being made between the past and the, pr and the future, because that is what the choice is. So somebody is making the choice to leave the past behind and focus on the future. Perhaps they were dealing with a bitch. That was nasty and jealous and uh, and uh, melodramatic. Maybe they 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 run into somebody. They they have to they run in. They run in to save somebody, and that's where it starts. They do run into somebody. Somebody's gonna run into somebody, and there's gonna be some sort of. A light bulb or a moment or a spark or something. So that's what I got. Good luck.